She's coming right at us right here. Ready? Welcome back, guys. Come here. Back it off. Come here. Hey, get in the video. Knock it off. All right, guys. So we're, we're out on Connor's property today. It's opening day of gun season. It's November 15th. It's a Friday. Connor just got off school and we snuck out. Uh, we're sitting by a log because Connor's seen a 140 inch deer. in front of us is where he walked out. It was the night that I shot a six point over there. The uh, same night I shot my buck, that would have been November 1st. So two weeks ago. Two weeks ago. And right after I shot him, when I saw him go down, a buck came out, that 140 inch buck came out right in front of us. I snort wheezed him and he turned around and ran right at me. And my mom called me, so I had to answer the phone. When I looked up, he was standing there at 40 yards broadside. And, and then, and then he the shot off. I couldn't get my bow in time. He just, he turned and looked at the button buck in front of me and chased him off. But we've had trail camera pictures of some big bucks around here. There's some, there's a fresh rub right over here. Or right over here. Here. From a, it's a pretty big, uh, Rob, and there's a big fresh scrape in their front yard, which is about 200 yards that way. And I'm on doe patrol tonight. Connor's waiting for a buck. But if we had a group of does come out in front of us, we're both going to try and shoot it. Shoot one. He's going to shoot one. I'm going to shoot one. We both got doe tags and one buck tag left. And we're going to have to keep our eyes out because we have a pie ball doe on the property that my buddy who co-hunts this property with me had it like 10 yards, about 200 yards up the hill. So, if there's a pretty good chance, he, he was telling me that there's a 100% chance we see deer tonight. At Base Cliff, we see one, we're shooting one, unless it's a small buck. So, we're gonna sit tight and try not to freeze our, to actually freeze our butts off because we're just sitting in the snow. But, um, wish us luck. We should be, uh, tagging out pretty quick here, bringing you guys some deer killing action. Your hands are gonna be cold because you put your hands in the snow. Out of all the times I've sat out of that saddle stand right there, the only, that 140 inch buck coming across was the only time I've had a deer come straight across here. You smoked her. She's coming right at us right here. Ready? <laughs> she's not here. She's small. I thought she was going to run us over. <gasps> Holy smokes. She just went down right there at two yards. Oh, blood right there. And then just dove up. Come she's on. dead. 
That's what a 450 the does. Squad, buddy. That's what the 450 does to the, the does. All right. You want to go check her out? She's done. No, it's just let her lay there. I can see her breathing. She is right there. Let Josh know I got her. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, shot I, I shot her like 60, 60 yards, yards and she ran straight at us. And, and died and, and, at and like four. Hit this, that tree right there. Down tree, she ran right into it. I got it all on footage too. Yeah, Connor got it all on film. Thank you. No buttons. Look at all these buttons. Goodbye.